What's up guys, this is Tony B Hunting Figs back at you with another quick, I call these micro haul. Um, good to be back, had a rough week and a half since um, I've been back from New York City, but that's a different story for a different video. Right now, um, I just wanted to show you guys a quick pickup. I'm gonna try to do also a toy hunting vlog this weekend. I'm gonna see if I hit up um, some of the spots that I've been watching some YouTubers talk about, like the Rosses, Marshalls, Targets, not Targets, um, TJ Maxx's, uh, what else? Um, I think that's about it. I know Walgreens is supposed to be closing a lot of their stores soon, so I'm gonna see if they have anything on sale as well. I think Burlington Co Factory, I don't know if I just said that. Um, I'm gonna check those out as well this weekend and hopefully bring you guys a good video see um, if I can get anything new. Um, but it feels good to put out another video. Um, just happy to do that, you know, toy hunting and collecting, bridging the joy. I wanna sh continue to share that joy with you guys. So without further ado, these are my pickups. And of course, <laughs> I, well, I wanna start off with this. Um, I saw that they've been releasing the uh, more Fast 10 diecast cars. Again, I don't collect all of them, just certain ones. Um, this one is the 2021 Dodge Charger SRT Hellcat, which was featured in the movie. Um, it's pretty awesome. I like Chargers, I don't have one personally, but um, it was my first patrol car back in New York. It was also assigned to me uh, when I got into law enforcement um, down in Virginia where I'm at. And um, I just have a connection with these Chargers, you know, they're just awesome looking, pretty badass. So I picked that up today and um, just added to the collection of the other diecast uh, Chargers that I got. I also picked up some games. I'm very excited um, that I picked up Super Mario Wonder uh, for the Switch. So that looks pretty fun. And when I went to GameStop, I guess it came with like a sticker book or something, which I thought was pretty, pretty awesome. Maybe I'll put that on my water bottle or something, but that came with the Mario Wonder. So definitely looking forward to playing that. Definitely had to pick up Spider-Man too. Um, this one came with some pre-order bonuses. It says uh, Arachnite suit and Shadow Spider suit. So I guess I can unlock those. I know you can't see, it's always a glare. I'm gonna try to fix those glare problems. But picked it up, PlayStation 5 Switch. Um, and then I picked up, I'm so glad that they finally released well, at least by me, they finally started to get the new wave of the old school Ninja Turtles. So I was able to find um, Mondo Gecko. So that was pretty awesome. Saw him and I saw April O'Neil. Had to pick it up. Um, I'm missing Ray Filet. They just didn't have him there. So I'm hoping when I go on my toy hunting vlog tomorrow, I'll be able to find it. And um, this is, I also went to Target and I picked up a Macho King Randy Savage. Um, I guess it's been out for a while because I have the, I have the Hogan and the Rock from this line. Um, I guess if I get the Dusty Rhodes, I can complete Mean Gene Okerlund. So I figured, you know what, if I find Dusty Rhodes, I'll get it. I might as well, if that's the last one to, to build Mean Gene, which is probably gonna be random <laughs> to find them at this point. But I always wanted a Macho Man. I have an NWO Macho Man. I just don't have a regular Macho Man. I'm just upset that it didn't come with the outfit, with his jacket in this one. I'm pretty sure if it was a, a regular elite white box, it probably would come with his jacket. But um, that would have been cool if they would at least gave the, the jacket. But Nevertheless, I wanted, you know, a Macho Man got a Macho Man. And this had me really excited when I found this, and it was the only one at the Walmart by me. Um, those figures, the Ninja Turtles were in uh, Martinsburg Walmart, and they didn't really have much wrestling or anything. And the Macho King was found at the Target at Martinsburg, which didn't have much, but that's the usual there. Um, they did have a Bishop there. I don't know why I didn't pick it up. 
I think I'm gonna pick it up next time. I think I'm just playing the long game and hoping that, you know, either it'll be on sale or maybe Ollie's will have them, but that's if I'm lucky. But anyway, I saw AEW Sting. This is from the, I think this is the Unrivaled collection. Yeah, so I found that, I was very excited. You don't know how much, how long I've been trying to find a Crow Sting. Um, so, this is the the last one that I guess came out. I mean, I, I know AEW came out with a bunch of versions of this thing. So I also saw Dan Housen. If I see it, I'm gonna pick up the Dan Housen. I like Dan Housen. I mean, I've never seen him wrestle, but I've been following um, Ethan Page, um, toy hunting, and I know Dan Housen is usually on there. So I'm waiting for Ethan Page. I believe he's coming out with a figure. I'm definitely gonna pick that up. And I guess I'll pick up the Dan Housen. Um, those are two that I would like to use as display pieces and maybe when they get assigned, it'll be a nice display piece. I want to definitely, if I get it, if I can find another thing like this, I'm going to pick it up. So I could leave one mint on card in the box as a nice display piece and maybe one day I could go to another Comic Con that Sting might appear at and just get it signed and put it in a nice case. Just, you know, these are the type of things that I like to leave in case as a nice display piece and just keep it. But I like to have two because I want to use one at Circle Photography. But I definitely want to just have one mint on card for a nice display piece and to hopefully get it signed. So that's pretty cool. So, so it's, uh, I'm already getting ideas with him and the crow figure that I bought. So that's going to be fun. Um, but that's my little macro haul for today. Again, I'm going to try to go and bring you guys more toy vlogs. Um, I hope you guys subscribe and share. And if you have any ideas of um, places that I could go, let me know. Uh, till then, glad you watched the video. Peace.